So what's up with y'all? Gonna give y'all um, the preview before the tent at night. Y'all can see straight through the mook, like tall guy said. Fishbowl, fishbowl. And then it don't make it no better that it has uh, the light interior. Man, I've owned this car for two weeks now and uh, rocking that fishbowl, man. This car has never been tinted a day in its life. Still got all of the original uh, stickers on it. And I parked uh, near the dealership so y'all can see just how uh, it looks at nighttime, regardless of uh, of light, headlights shining through it being parked. It's still the same because that light interior and then clear glass, excuse me. And I got this nice, uh, well, not that nice, but an okay uh, G37 over here. Oh my goodness, peeling for days. The interior is clean though, so maybe she just she just sat outside and wasn't uh, yeah she definitely just sat outside and wasn't uh, well loved for headlights all yellow. A lot of the other stuff on the car is you know sun damage, so yeah she sat outside. Man, this roof it would need a whole new paint job, maybe even a wrap. And they asking fourteen for this? No sir. Unless y'all are paying for um, a whole paint job, yeah, for sure. But no. But uh, I guess I'll uh, get in the car for y'all. I mean, it's not gonna make a difference at all. The regular light, no tint, no tint, dirty windshield. I mean, nothing crazy. <laughs> Um, yeah. Fishbowl. Y'all see me right there. But, um, that's it. That's all. Probably, I don't know if I'm going to, yeah, I'm probably just going to include this in to the, uh, other video. So, I'll see y'all whenever the car gets tinted. Peace. Oh, wait, actually, i see y'all in the morning whenever we do the morning video with no tint. Peace. My kids, my kids like it because they're like, oh, this car makes sense. I can see everything right there because they're used to watching the screens anyway. Mm -hmm. It's crazy. It's like a little, little game system. Yeah, and actually when the car's parked, you can actually watch Netflix on the screen. That's what's up. Or some other streaming services too. You can play uh, music through Spotify. Tesla's match. Yeah, it doesn't have any traffic on this, uh, this interface. So, so when you when you're going to go somewhere, you put in the address, and uh -huh. it'll tell you the charging stations. Like if you're going like a long distance, right? They'll tell you where you should stop to charge your car, because you know Tesla's got that network of superchargers right. throughout the country. So usually you drive two hours and you charge for 20 minutes. So okay. You drive another two hours. And there's a, there's, there's a, the nearest one to my house is at a Wawa gas station, so. Yeah, there's three superchargers around the city. Uh -huh. There's one near the Target on the north side. There's one on, in the east end. I guess there's a Target there, too. And then there's one on the south side, right off Jefferson Davis, I guess. Yeah, that's the one that's near my house. And I, I use all three of them. Do they still refer, like, is that, did they change the name of that road? Jefferson Davis. Is it, is it Richmond Highway now? Like, no, I don't, I don't think they changed it yet. Huh. I forgot about that. I'm still, I still wouldn't get used to that. I still call I it Jeff Davis. Or JD, I always call it that. I bought 
this when they were about 32,000. Yeah. Now I, I think they're around 40. Yeah, I was upset about it because I was looking at, um, I was telling my guy that I was looking at one, to buy one of these, like uh, 2020, I had bought a different car and um, I had looked at the prices and I was just like, man. Yeah, you can get a loan for Tesla, like a three, two or two and a half percent loan or something like that. Mm -hmm. And that's what I did. I just, I didn't put, I probably put any money down and I took a loan out. And Yeah, it's been it's been good. I mean, obviously, like there's sticker. Sh I've never owned a new car before, so mm -hmm. there was sticker shock initially. But overall, you know, your maintenance costs, your gas costs are less. Yeah. And like really. What's up, y'all? I don't know if y'all seen my other video, the short that I uploaded. Um, I did 15%. This regular black tent on uh, my 06 TSX. And uh, came out real nice. Was done by my guy, Ultraviolet Tint Anthony. Do not roll down. Uh, door hinge creak. But yeah, looks real good. I see, I see two pieces of trash in the window. Now that I'm actually sitting here on the inside, I see only two. It's not bad for his brand new shop. The back, of course, I was expecting that on the quarter window just a little bit. Um, on this rear one, mm. uh, two specks in the left hand corner this side, but nothing. The back, um, he had to do luckily, I caught it. It was a little finger, little finger, it was like right there, maybe that was forming. So I went on ahead and told him about that, came out, and, uh, you know, owned up to his mistake and fixed it up. No questions asked. Bought out the big torch, too, not the little one. That was cool to see. I like watching uh, tent videos. There's a bunch of uh, water bubbles in it right now. But like I said, I went darker than what I would normally go because the car is uh, lighter for the interior tan interior so i put I'm put my book bag in the uh seat so y'all can see now this is this will be like the darkest point for any tent hopefully i'm blocking out some of that wind for y'all but this will be like the darkest point this front side for any tent now um you can't see my book bag you can see my water bottle pretty well um you can see you can see like the the tan stuff in the car but you can't really like really look until you bring up to the inside and now you can see what's inside the car i wasn't doing i don't like five percent it's just too dark for me personally um ten percent is a sweet spot well no no 15 is a sweet spot for me uh with the light interior color but with black i'd go 20. this all depends on what you like your state laws and stuff like that if you're willing to take those risks if not understandable but it's looking real good not now i definitely uh feel like excuse me since i haven't been in my q50 i it feels it feels really different um excuse me i don't know why why whenever i start talking to y'all i start having to to belch not burp but um yeah, it looked real good, man. I'm excited. So now I can drive around the car and not be mad that the sun is just smacking my face. But now you got to go back for the uh, the windshield. I'm not sure if I'm going to do just regular uh, 50 ceramic or if I'm going to do um, like a reflective 50. I'm not doing... Uh, 35 or anything like that this will be my daily my daily baby i'm not doing that um number one i can't see that well at night and two uh it's just just too much attention but um from the cops of course because as soon as i left out his brand new shop his is uh his new shop is more so close to uh, if y'all are familiar with the rva area you know that his new shop the Mechanicsville area is uh, 
closer to Richmond. So there's uh, a lot of cops around there. For sure, for sure. That's a place to get burnt at. As soon as I, I'm leaving at the stop sign, we're going to wait for him to go. But like I said, as soon as I'm leaving and waiting at the stop sign, there's a, a state trooper turning left into the parking lot. I'm just like, oh my goodness. Luckily, you know, I'm faced uh, towards him with the windshield, so he can't see the sides until he passes it. But, um, and then I get down the street, like literally 500 feet down the street. And there's a cop sitting there waiting. And then I keep going. There's another cop sitting there waiting for ticketers. I didn't know that that spot was that hot because I don't I don't go in the uh, Mechanicsville area a lot. But um, I'm just rambling, y'all. So I'm gonna go ahead and let y'all go. Hope y'all enjoyed this. Uh, follow the Instagram. Subscribe. Comment down below. Yeah, that's how it looks. I think it looks really dark right there, but I say like yeah, like there is how it really looks in person. I'm gonna have to review the footage and uh, might come back with the nighttime. No, 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 this is going in the tent video. So I'm gonna make a whole nother uh, dedicated video to this. So peace y'all.